In this video, we are going to learn um, and to continue learning Microsoft Excel. We are going to create basic worksheets into any data, formatting forms, formatting numbers, alignment shape using some of our page. And um, we are going to start with blank sheets. Um, our black sheet is going to be uh, ABC. I'm going to say ABC. Okay. School. And I'm going to change the formatting, or I'm going to click and drag between A and B to. There is a line between A and B. I'm going to click and drag it. I'm going to change the width of my column. And now I'm going to create my own my own worksheet. And here I'm going to say names. I'm going to say here grades. So I'm going to put names over here. Any name, you can type any name, or the same, similar to me. And then, we are going to make grades for them over here. So, I'm going to put here number. And these are my grades for my students and here is my sheet, small sheet and now I'm going to change grades into right alignment so I'm going to click here in the alignment uh, shortcut toolbar or button and here is my right alignment so I'm going to click it and now it is right aligned with my numbers. And I'm going to put here some, and I'm going to put here my average. So this sheet, simple sheet now, is uh, my uh, lesson today. So we did the right alignment over here. Now I want to make also bold ABC school and names and grades into a bold font. So I'm going to change the formatting of my font. Okay. So first I want to change the type of my font. And here is my shortcut. The shortcut of my font. And I'm going to click the arrow down and I'm going to change it over here into another different font which is similar here to area and I'm going to change the size of it so I'm going to make it at least 16 and I'm going to change also the color of my font into this icon I'm going to click the E and here is my color and uh, the, the default of the font in Microsoft Excel and most of the softwares is automatic, which is the black. And I'm going to change it into a different one, which is the dark blue. I'm going to click on it. And then I'm going to use my other shortcut, which is the B for the bold. I want my font or my text to be bold. I'm going to click bold. And I'm going to change names and grades the same thing. But I want to make them just bold. So I'm going to click this B, bold. And now I'm going to also change the colors of my background. Okay, and now I'm going to select this small table. And I'm going to use a different color here this box 
this short box is the cell color of my background cell and I'm going to click this box and I'm going to choose one simple and nice color which is this color and I'm going to uh, make my sum and average also bold so that I know that these are important to me so now I'm going to start the sum I'm going to start a formula if I want to start a formula in Microsoft Excel I have to click or just use the equal sign first so I'm going to press the equal sign and now I'm starting a formula in Microsoft Excel it's very important that I have to use equal sign to start my formula and then I'm going to type SUM which is the sum as I type sum you can see that a drop box down comes in or pop ups and I'm going to start my formula and I'm going to make or select the numbers which I want to sum before I do that I have to first open the bracket so that I can select so I'm going to open a bracket and I'm going to select this range from B6 to B9 so I'm going to click and drag it over here then I'm going to close my bracket and then I'm going to press enter see the beauty of Microsoft Excel it comes the number 335 so it is the sum and you can see up there here in the formula bar sum b6 column b9 it means the range between b6 to b9 which is the numbers in this range and it sums them to me and now I'm going to uh, do the same thing with average but now I have to type the average so I'm going to start my formula with pressing equal and then average and then I'm going to open my bracket so Microsoft Excel is very smart and it helps me that's why this menu the pop-ups menu comes in down to help me which function I am using or I want to use so I'm going to also select the same range over here and I'm going to close my bracket again so and press enter so here my average and here my total so now I am just done with my first sheet and I've done formatting and we've done the changing font and alignment we've done this so far we created basic worksheet enter data format forms formatting numbers, alignments, shapes, and using some average. You can see that um, this worksheet is very uh, simple and very basic and anybody can do it and it's very uh, nice to learn this. I hope you just uh, learn how to uh, create your simple basic worksheet and I'm going to see you in other sessions and we are going to do more things I hope you enjoyed this uh, lesson and video okay bye